Battery-powered electric vehicles are literally shocking the world, appealing to a fast-growing group of price and environmentally conscious consumers. The question now is precisely when will electric cars leave their current luxury or green tech niches and enter the mainstream? WSJ Heard on the Street Steve Wilmot says that depends above all on relative cost. And on that front, electric vehicles have momentum. But since gasoline-powered vehicles may remain supreme for at least another decade, he says, investors still need to watch to ensure they don't get caught on the wrong side of history. The plummeting cost of batteries is key. The growth of mobile computing has driven massive investment in the area, improving the range of electric cars while reducing their production costs. And the industry already has a model to follow. Tesla is showing that there's consumer demand for well-designed electric cars, spurring nearly all the the industry's incumbents from Detroit to Germany to Japan to invest heavily. General Motors is due to release its all-electric Chevrolet Bolt in the coming weeks at a post-tax price of $30,000, less than the average car sale price in America, though high for a compact. Tesla's much-hyped Model 3 is expected late next year at a slightly lower price, but retaining relevance and profits in the electric era will be a challenge for traditional car makers. However, that won't stop them from trying. Germany's big three, VW, Daimler, and BMW, have all unveiled new electric vehicle strategies this year. As a result, the next few years will bring about a flurry of launches to rival the Bolt and the Model 3. So how should investors tackle the biggest disruption the auto industry has encountered in decades? Shares in nearly all car makers, bar Tesla, are currently very cheap, both relative to their trading history and the wider market. And WSJ's Wilmot predicts that in time, the companies that survived the rapids of industrial chains could be seen and valued more like tech companies.